By 2020, analysts predict 10 to 13 percent of all cars sold will be electric vehicles. But in the near term, it could be a bumpy ride. Michael Canellis is the editor in chief of Green Tech Media in San Francisco. He says the biggest challenge facing EVs right now is cost. Electric vehicles cost a lot because batteries cost a lot. Now the price is going to go down over time. But right now, an electric economy car without subsidies might cost $40,000. A regular economy car might cost $20,000. Another challenge, lack of charging stations. Once you buy the car, where and how do you charge it? Basically, if you bought an EV now and start driving it around, you'd have, you'd have very few places to charge it. If you didn't have a charger in your home, you had luck there. Finding one in public, you know, there's some from the early 90s out there, but half of them don't work. So if you're driving around, you run out of power, you're out of power. But John Reed, CEO of Ecotality, is working to change that in 2011. His company is in a race with other manufacturers to roll out charging stations nationwide. The plan? To make them accessible in every home, but also to put thousands on the road. We're putting in 15,000 chargers in seven states that range from Washington State all the way across to Tennessee. So it's right around the corner and it's really going to follow the footprint and the path of the cars themselves. Places like Best Buy, Costco and Cracker Barrel will soon have stations for people to easily charge their EVs for 15 to 20 minutes while on the go. So is 2011 at last the year of the electric vehicle? Analysts say it could be the start of something big. Why? First, Although the cost of electric vehicles is more expensive, it's cheaper to charge than fill up. Let's say you go 20 miles in a car. U.S. car gets about 20 miles a gallon. That's going to cost you $3. To go 20 miles on electricity, that's less than a dollar, maybe 60 cents. And second, there's a lot of pent-up demand. Consumers are excited to start driving EVs. Everyone loves electric cars. Once you sit behind the wheel of one, you're sold. They're a blast to drive. It's almost like the second coming of the muscle car era. People are going to love their cars again. For Bnet, I'm Sumi Das.